Hey guys, so I thought I'd do the video on my craft table. I am, um, I haven't cleaned it, and I'm sorting through boxes of craft stuff, so um, I've got some stuff on my table that won't really stay on my table. And I've got this on a tripod, so I, I may move this camera, I may not, I don't know yet. I just do what feels right. So, um, I'm actually working on a project right now that I'm going to be doing a tutorial of. Um, I made these button trees. So, I was trying to figure out a way to use up buttons. Cause I usually don't like to use, you know, like the plain run-of-the-mill buttons for, for flower centers. I prefer the shank ones. So, I was trying to figure out, you know, how to use my boring buttons. So, anyways, I did those trees because, and then I'll be a, here's another spool over here. I'll do a tutorial with this one. I already distressed it because it has to dry. And I've just got my my twine that I use for the tutorial, or that I'm gonna use for the tutorial. Um, got my glue. Uh, I guess my craft table is not very interesting. Um, yeah, it's not. Um. <laughs> This thingy over here, the spice rock. I keep my pom poms in it and um, charms uh, and yo yos. Uh, and candy canes and um, weird things that Shay gave me. I don't know what they are, but they're there. And come over here. I keep this on top, and this just has my ribbon roses and oh, not that you can see it, and bows in it. That's on top of the spice rack, and then this is on top of that, and. This has my altered art tiles that I have yet to use on anything. Some of them Leslie gave me. Some of them I made. I love these gifts where I can stick things in them. <laughs> you know, where they serve a purpose. I'm very much into making things or altering things that also function as storage. <laughs> um, let's see here. If I can get this closed. I know I can do it. I can get it closed. Okay. Um. See, back here. What do I have back here? What is this? Um. This is something I got at the, at the Goodwill. Um. I guess there's some thread spools in here and some remnants of a dream catcher kit that I did that um, didn't end up looking like a dream catcher and I guess this basket I um, stuck some weird stuff in I guess there's some lace in here um, I don't know if you'd consider that lace or not. This is really weird, um, cut up stuff. I get a lot of my, my crafting supplies from my mother. Cause she used to be a very versatile crafter. Now all she does is bead jewelry making. Okay, I'll have to fix that later. Um... And then I have a 
I carry basket majigger thing back here and I keep some stuff fell. Um, I keep my makeup sponges and there's some organza bags for stuff. There's some paper. Um, that I'm not using. I'm I'm using part of it. I'm using I'm using this sheet here. For the for the button trees. It's Tim Holtz paper. But I've just got um gel pins and pens and these jelly marker majiggers. I don't know what they are. And then I've got some artwork from Leslie back here. And then I've got a, another basket back here that has wire and weird stuff in it. I, I don't remember what it is. Um, or remember what's all that's in there. I don't know. I've got some caulk in there. And then I've got a coloring, or it's actually not a coloring book. It's um, a binder full of um, coloring pages for when I um, feel like being a small child again and like to color. And I think I'm going to pick up the camera. Maybe. Maybe not. I've got my Ot light there. You can see the Ot light. Here's my duck. It has quack quack. It has appliques in it. Yes, I did just quack on camera. Um, some wedding appliques, some <laughs> some peacock feather appliques, and I'm not quite sure where that duck is gonna live yet. And then scooching over and getting glue out of the way. Um, this thingy over here, I also got at Goodwill. I have yet to paint it yet. It really needs to be painted. I've had it for like a year. It was somebody's craft project, I guess. But I keep um, flat back. I, I don't know well. Uh, I don't know. Let me see what I keep. Okay, here's some some bells. Some bottles. You know those nail thingies. Um hold on one second. Can't get close with the tripod. Here's some googly eyes. Some reindeer things that Bonnie gave me. I'm still not sure what they are, but they sure are fun to craft with. Um some of those recollection sticker things. Mummy bought them for me for birth for for birthday. For Christmas. Or maybe no, I think Santa Claus bought me those. Here's some mirrors. Uh here's some paper mache shapes. Here's some flat back things. I what they're called. Here's some bigger bells. Um, and I'm sorry, the rest of the video is probably going to be really shaky because I'm holding the tripod. And then I've just got some big sheets of washi paper here. And then 
Um, this cap I keep my uh, lip loom pens that Bonnie gave me. I was gonna try and see if these work like the Tombow water marker majigs. Be cool if it did. And then I've got you know paint pens that don't work very well. And I've got my blue pen. And then and then this is something that Leslie made for me. And I keep all my my game pieces in there. So that would be the end of the tour of my craft table. I know it was really exciting. I guess I've got some fabric on my table that I'm not using. Um, Here's a dove that I cut out of a greeting card. Some floral picks. And some model magic. Uh, no, here, here's a gravy jar. Some confetti. Some candle wax remover. This stuff was so awesome. It doesn't really work too great, but I mean it when it whenever you spray it, it makes things really cold. I'm kind of afraid to spray it on my finger. But I'm still really tempted to out of curiosity. Um Yeah. So, I guess that would be it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Oh. Here's a turtle. Yeah. I guess I could go through my charms. Little pom poms. Bigger pom poms. Same size pom poms. Uh, weird. Uh, I don't know what they are. They're flat back some things. Um, here's my candy canes. And my yo-yos. There's a couple miniature heart doilies in there. Uh, my cat's going to the bathroom, so if you hear some cat litter scratching, that would be the reason why. Here's some slightly bigger than tiny pom-poms. Here's some barrettes. Some googly eyes. Don't ask me why I have so much googly eyes. I'll never tell some more pom-poms or don't ask me why I have a slight obsession with pom-poms I actually do use pom-poms here's the weird things that Shay bought me that I don't know what they are and or not bought me, got me, whatever and these are more pom-poms, they're just brown so yeah, that would be my grand tour of my super fantastic um, craft table. So thanks for watching. Bye.